In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change and configure Microsoft Edge proxy settings. Whether you're troubleshooting a network issue or just need to tweak your internet settings for better performance, understanding how to configure your proxy settings can be very useful. By the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to navigate through Microsoft Edge to adjust these settings effectively. To begin, you'll need to launch the Microsoft Edge browser. Simply click on the Edge icon to open it up. Once you have Microsoft Edge open, direct your attention to the top right corner of the screen. You'll see a series of three dots, which is the menu button commonly referred to as settings and more. Click on these three dots and a drop down menu will appear. From this list, select settings. This will take you to the settings page where you'll find various options to personalize and configure your browser. In the settings menu, look to the left hand side and find the section labeled system and performance. Once there, select system. This step is crucial as it gets you closer to accessing the proxy settings. Now, under the system section, you should see the option to open proxy settings. Click on it, and this action will redirect you to your operating system's proxy settings page. It's important to note here that changes you make will actually affect your entire network connection on your device, not just Microsoft Edge. At this point, you'll have two choices, an automatic proxy setup or a manual proxy setup. For many users, the automatic proxy setup will suffice as it tends to take care of the most common network configurations without requiring much input. However, if your network has specific requirements or you're following custom guidelines, you may opt for a manual setup. If you decide to proceed with a manual setup, you'll need to provide the proxy server address and the port number. Usually this information is supplied by your network administrator or internet service provider. Make sure to enter these details correctly to avoid any connection issues. Furthermore, there's an optional feature where you can enter any exceptions. This is found under the section, use the proxy server except for addresses that start with the following entries. It allows certain addresses to bypass the proxy if necessary. Separate each entry with a semicolon to ensure they are correctly formatted. Once you have configured your settings and are satisfied with the changes, simply click the save button. This will apply all your adjustments and your network connection will now utilize the configured proxy settings. And that's it. You've successfully changed and configured your Microsoft Edge proxy settings. Make sure to test your internet connection to confirm everything is working as expected. Thank you for watching, and I hope this guide has been helpful. Be sure to subscribe for more tips and tutorials.